What's up everybody, Kevin here, and in today's video, I'm gonna be bringing you a video of Rainbow Six Siege and today for you guys, I'm gonna be bringing you another episode of the best class setups. Today, we're gonna be looking at Capkin's weapon. So this is gonna be the 9X19 VSN. This thing is a literally beast and uh, this is gonna be also with a new operator that's gonna be coming out. Which, most likely with this video here, this season will be out. So, uh, this weapon is the exact same weapon as the new operator is using. So, uh, you could copy this class set of video and it's going to be the exact same performance. Obviously, the new operator is a lot faster. Capkin is more of a, um, of a sit back, you know not rushing operator for defending so uh so yeah so this is it right over here so right now what i'm rolling is reflex sight but obviously with the new season there's gonna be different ones but uh, i would try reflex sight or the other holographic scope because that's gonna be literally insane and uh right now i'm rolling with the reflex and there's a couple of days left before the new season so i think i might either switch to the new holographic i mean the old one or I might just stick with the reflex sights because I really enjoyed this one. So I tried the 1.5, didn't really enjoy it. I find the reflex sight more, a lot better. And then for the barrels, I use flash hider. Of course, this reduces the speed. I wish the muzzle moves upwards while shooting. So you won't have a uh, a lot of recoil while shooting this weapon. This, this thing is pretty accurate, not gonna lie. I mean, it is accurate like crazy. So look, suppressor. You got the compensator. There's barely any difference between these two, okay? Then you go to the to the flash hider. You can see that the spread is tighter, which that's what you want. And then this one over here, the muzzle brake. Yeah, it reduces the overall weapon kick, but this one over here, if you're, if you're spraying, you're going to have a lot better control on the weapon. So I would go with flash hider. So for grips, you got vertical grip and you got angled grip, to be honest. Vertical grip, as you can see the difference between angle and vertical, look at this. Look at the look at the bottom right. Boom. Angled, vertical. Angled, vertical. So obviously the vertical grip is gonna obviously decrease the weapon's recoil by a lot. As you can see, if you're if you're trying to hit shoulder, it's gonna it's gonna hit the head in five bullets. Just because of the weapon, obviously it's gonna have that bit of recoil, but the vertical grip is going to make you uh, save on pulling down your arm, you know, <laughs> if that makes sense. So I would go with vertical grip. Angled grip is if you're just peeking like crazy and um, yeah, if, if you're a peeker, angle grip. If you're just in the, in the sit corner, I would go with vertical grip. So that is for the grips. Under barrel, no laser sight. Why would you want a laser sight? The enemies could see your laser, so there's no point of putting on the laser that is pretty much it for this class set of video i'm gonna be leaving you guys some gameplay of me shredding with this weapon and of me you know be i consider myself a pro with capkin i'm i'm pretty good with him and uh most of the time i get a lot of kills with his uh ability of course his booby traps so um so yeah so that is pretty much it for this video here if you guys did watch and enjoy this and you want to see more rainbow six siege on the channel give this video a like subscribe if you're new and of course, for the gadget, I'm missing this up, but for the gadget, you can either use imp I use impacts because most of the time I solo queue and, you know, I want to make the rotations. Some people don't have impacts and some people don't have shotguns, so I would make the rotations with impacts. And uh, yeah, that is pretty much it for this video. And uh, I'll leave you guys some gameplay to watch. Thank you all for watching. Hope you all have an awesome day and peace out. One's in kitchen sledge. Uh, this hatch is soft. No. Pick up on his up here. One friendly operator remaining. Okay, Habana's lobby. Sledge is open area. On the left. No open area. Walking down main street. One up, four remaining. On a main street. Off four eliminated. 
shit, dude. Thanks. Neat. Good callouts, man. Let's go. That was a four-piece, man. Come on. It could have been an ace. Come on.